that's another match day vlog. Uh, it's another away day. It's uh, Stoke City versus Swansea City in the Skyrack Championship. 7.45 kick off on a Tuesday night. Um, yeah, it's a game, um, you know, I'm, I'm not, I am looking forward to it. Um, obviously, though, Stoke, they haven't been on the best form. Lost to Chef Wednesday in our last game. And then, obviously, under Alan Sheehan, our, our um, interim manager, uh, we beat Rotherham United on last weekend. So, it's a game I'm looking forward to. Um, you know, I'm just about to go meet some of the boys now. Jake, uh, unfortunately, isn't coming. Uh, neither is uh, Jake of either. But, uh, yeah, I'm going down with my college mates today, just going for some breakfast now. Um, and then, obviously, we'll get down to the stadium. Bus needs a half to. Then we'll get down to the stove. Probably take about four hours to get there overall. So, yeah, it should be good. But, yeah, as I just said, uh, Jake, uh, unfortunately, can't make this game. So, I'll hand it over to him so he can give you his thoughts on the game. Hi guys, obviously as Luke mentioned, I won't be able to make the game tonight. Um, we'll be watching it on TV. Um, I know I haven't been to as many away games this season as I did last season. But, you know, Christmas is approaching and, uh, you know, everything is a bit expensive. So, um, yeah, um, I will be watching the game from home though. Um, hopefully we can get a win. Obviously Luke will be vlogging the game. Um, Prediction-wise... I'm gonna say I'm gonna say Stoke City one, Swansea City two. I am gonna be confident. Same score as Rotherham. Um, I'm gonna say um, to score the goals for us. I'm gonna go with Jamie Patterson and Jamal Lowe. And to get the goal for Stoke, I'm gonna go with Kiana Hoover. But yeah, uh, back over to Luke. Uh, so hi Luke here. Uh, Pre-match food here. What have you got? Well, we just got to Burger. We just stopped off at the services. Got some uh, chili heat waves to eat and fries beer. Uh, I'm getting my cracks, see what they're like. Mm. They are tender, delicious. Nice. Very nice, good taste. Got anything else? Um, Fucking rip off. Well, have a check. 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 Have all right, excellent. Thank you, mate. Here we are. So we've got team line up. Uh, Raj Wilf in goal. Put the back. We've got Josh Key right back. Josh Pang on left back. Two centre backs down. Van Gogh. The field. We've got Grimes and Bolton. Uh, and then you've got the three um, moving forwards. You've got Yates, Patino, and Patterson. And Jamalo up front. I don't see Yates being on the wing. It's probably low on the wing. But that's what it says on uh, is it Fuck, Fuck Marble Time. Yeah. And then, yeah, on the, on the bench, we've got... Uh, yeah, bench for us. We've got Andy Fisher, Cal Norton. Uh, Bashir Humphreys, uh, Parker, Liam Walsh, Balassi, Liam Cullen, Molly Cooper and Cameron Pongo. <laughs> yeah, so we've got Marnie and Sexy Dogs here. Uh, what's your thoughts today against Stoke then? Uh, what's your prediction? I'm not going to lie. Um, considering Stoke sacked Alex Neal on Sunday, was it? Yeah, um, Sunday, yeah. I don't think um, they will turn the tide as much as we did against Rotherham. Yeah. So, in terms of score prediction, I'll go with two on Swans, and I'll go with Jerry Yates, Charlie Patino, and Kijana Hoover. I hope so. Come on, come on, come on, Ian. Is that then? Number three, come on, it's time, isn't it? Yeah, that's yeah. Um, what I said to Marty, first of all, I went 2-2. Two -two. I saw the players come out. I had high hopes. Changed my score prediction. I'm going to go for 3-2 Swans today, right? Swans, I, so. I feel it lucky because we got a new yeah, chat. Yeah, 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 yeah. So... I go for the 3 2 win. I said Jerry H, Jamal Lowe, and Yannick Balassi off the bench. Well, Jerry and Balassi off the bench. Tell them your turn. I'm going 2 1 Swans. Yannick! Yannick Balassi! Yannick Balassi off the bench. Yannick Balassi! 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 Yannick your connection. 2-0 Swans, mate. Your connection. 2-0 Yeah, my score prediction for tonight, I'm going to go for 2-1 Swans. I'm getting confident. I feel like we have a good enough squad. I feel like we have a good enough squad to beat Stoke tonight. You know, they're on shit form. You know, they lost to our chef wins in the last game. We beat Barbara. I know we were quite lucky, but we still won the game. And, you know, the thing is, they're not going to play managed perhaps, you know, especially with Stoke. Anything can happen, so... I'm, I'm going to go on Swans, I'm confident. Uh, goal scorers, I'll go for... Jamie Patterson! Uh, I actually don't know. Uh, I'll go for Jerry Yates, uh, Jamie Patterson. Uh, yeah. so, oh, I think it's good for Stoke, actually. Um, I think I'll go for... Oh, Jerry, come on, mate. I'll go for Daniel Johnson. <laughs>
25-30 minutes, but then it was still they grew into the game, um, and then they started having chances. They had a few free kicks and corners. But I think, I think both teams have a few corners to be honest. But yeah, it's been quite a, quite an average game so far. Obviously, nothing's really good, gone on. No goals. Um, and yeah, it's been quite a boring game. You know, I, you know, I, I don't think any team has, has you know deserved to be winning so far. Um, you know, so can make the rest of it dodge on a few occasions. You know, you know, like a wrangle challenge. You know, maybe it was a bit debatable, maybe in their eyes, but. Yeah, obviously it's uh still now so far, it's not great, it's not like it was. But uh, yeah, we definitely expect changes, Glass has to come on. I think Ollie, I think Ollie Cooper definitely has to come on. Um, you know, I think Rashwick has been dodgy with, with a few, you know, kicks. Um, you know, he's, he's made a good save, don't get me wrong, especially if, um, that one when he had to make the save and Josh Tyman blocked it. But um, yeah, overall, no, no, first half, it's not looking like great. But hopefully we can try and turn on in you know, the second half and hopefully try and play a bit better. Yeah, so this one's having a half time change. They take it off the Tino and then brought on Yannick Balassi. So we'll see how that plays out. Daniel Johnson penalty. You know, not much you heard on there. It was a definite penalty, they got a penalty. So, one and up. To be honest, you know, in, in the second half, we haven't turned up at all. You know, it's still going to be better so far in the second half. So, but, you know, I suppose they have to do it to one and up. So, yeah, one nil down. 70th minute now. So, only 20 minutes to go. That's out of time. So, you know, who knows what's going to happen. But, yeah, one nil still already. Uh, no, I think it's
boys are in. back in the game now. Come on, boys. Yeah, so I finished um, so, uh, Stoke City 1, Swansea City 1. Um, yeah, it's not really a result we wanted or needed. Um, you know, it's second half, we went great to be honest. I thought Stoke and 1 was the best late in the second half. I thought first half, we got to be quite well. And I think it was slightly better in the first half. But in the second half, Stoke, you know, they made their subs and they just changed the game. You know, we brought on Yannick Balassi, you know, he was decent. He wasn't amazing, but he was alright when he came in. You know, had a few nice touches, one as a free kick. So, you know, he did, he did alright, but... Yeah, I want to draw against Stoke, a team that's struggling, a team that just recently sacked their manager. Like, I, I know we're a team that haven't, you know, we haven't got a manager yet as well. But um, you know, it's just a one-on draw against Stoke. It's not a great, it's not a great result. It's not. You know, it wasn't a great performance either. Overall, you know, I respect the players who try and obviously getting that point in the end, which is something that was really needed. But um, yeah, it's just, it's just not a great result. It's, it was a completely average game. It wasn't amazing. And um, yes, yeah, a one-on draw on a cold, wet, windy. Uh, night in Stoke, so yeah, it's not great, but it is what it is. But um, yeah, thank you for watching this video. Obviously, if you are new, uh, please uh, subscribe. That would be massively appreciated. Uh, leave a like if you enjoyed the video, and then we'll be back on Friday night for the, the preview for Borough at Home. So stay tuned and thanks for watching.